Welcome back you lovely bunch, thanks for tuning again. I hope you're all doing good. Right, bit of a product review today. I've been sent these headphones from Oladance. So if you do like listening to music whilst you're riding or running or at the gym, but you still want to be able to hear everything around you, worth checking these out. They're not bone conducting, so they don't sit on your temples or just above your ears here to make the music go through your head. They actually have a speaker, so this kind of eliminates wind noise. The one thing I've noticed with bone conduction headphones is the wind noise is appalling. Let's get these unboxed and I'll show you what you get in the box and all this stuff. I've got a little special extra gift, this little like wireless Bluetooth button. Let's get these unboxed and I'll talk you through them. So they're nicely packaged, you do get a protective case inside the box. It's charging cable and that's pretty much all you need. So on first inspection, they feel really sturdy, light. The buttons are really pronounced and feel quite nice to click. Very clickable, I like a clickable button. Which means when you're running or riding and you've got gloves on, you can still access the buttons and you can still kind of feel where they are. There's three buttons there, so it should be fairly easy to function whilst on the move and out on the go. So they're not actually bone conducting, it has like this dual speaker set up. Can you see this? There you go, like a very nice little speaker. And then obviously when you put them on, there's quite a good fit. So it feels quite snug and nice. They're IPX8 waterproof rated, so that means you're never gonna have to worry about running or riding in like torrential British weather. The battery life is 15 hours. If you plug them in, they actually will do a quick charge. So you plug them in to charge for 15 minutes, this will give you five hours of playtime. Random fact as well, you can leave these headphones on standby for three years. That seems far too long to actually be correct, but apparently they have some patented like smart function stuff inside them. And yeah, so you can leave them on standby for three years. You can connect them to multiple devices, so I can have them connected to my phone and my laptop, so if I'm switching between the two. So one of the issues for me of using normal in-ear headphones is I can only wear one. You still get to hear your music, but you don't get that like immersed feeling. But then you don't want to be immersed in the music when you want to be aware of traffic and everything around you. So that's when like bone conduction headphones came in. I like the idea of bone conducting headphones, but my issue is that with bone conducting headphones, whenever you're riding along and you go down a slight hill or you get some speed up, the noise from the wind is insane and you can't hear any music. So there's literally no point in having it on. I might as well just sellotape my phone to my head and that would give me better audio than a bone conduction pair of headphones in the wind. So the microphone in headphones can be quite bad. The wind noise can mean that you can't talk on the phone on them. And I do spend a lot of time on the phone and I do like to be on hands free. So for me, a microphone that works on a pair of headphones would be awesome. So I did give these a test out yesterday on the bike whilst riding along and they were perfect. I could hear the person that I was talking to perfectly as they could hear me perfectly. Normally I'd have to stop, hide out of the wind, pull like my jacket up or top so I'm like hiding my headphones from the wind. And literally I'm using headphones like this because all you can hear is wind. And it's not really very ideal, is it? I mean, at that point, you might as well just get your phone out and hold your phone to your ear. These sit kind of just above your ears. Can I show you where they sit? So they kind of sit here and the little speaker kind of does project the music into your ear. And they have this like wind counseling noise reduction thing. So I went out yesterday, it was a very windy day and I could hear my music the entire time. I did in fact find myself turning my music down from full volume because I could hear it well enough in both and it was actually a little bit too loud, which is something that you don't get from like around the ear kind of sports headphones. Quite often I've noticed that the music is very quiet and I wanna be able to hear the music, I wanna be immersed in it, but you can still hear the traffic. So it's, it's kind of ideal, right? So on a dance, also have an app. You can connect your headphones. Can you see this to the app? And here you can change like the graphic equalizer. It has presets for like voice music, all this sort of stuff. So you can actually tweak stuff with the headphones. So you're not just limited to the default settings. So if you do listen to mostly podcasts, you can tweak the sound so it sounds perfect when people are talking. Headphones like this, I've done so many reviews, they always fit under a helmet, they always fit with like sunglasses, they always fit perfectly. The issue that I always have with them is the sound quality and you always have to make a bit of a compromise. Like I want to be able to hear the world around me but I also want to listen to music. But these OWS headphones seem to work really, really well. And look, a nice fetching yellow color as well. So you look very fetching. They are available in other colors. I'm not actually a fan of the yellow. I'd much prefer another color, but I didn't actually specify what color I wanted. So I got sent the yellow ones. Something else that kind of excited me even more than these headphones. Well, it didn't excite me more. It's an excellent pairing to it. And that is this little box here. This is a Bluetooth button. This is amazing, this thing. I didn't think this would be quite so useful. Once I saw it in the box, I was like, ah, what is that? This looks a bit weird. Look, check it out. 
And what you do is, this connects to the headphones. So what I do with this is I normally attach it to my bibs or somewhere, but for the sake of the video, let's attach it here. Right, so I'll be riding along. I'm in gloves, it's freezing cold, it's raining, it's awful weather. Someone's calling me and I want to answer the phone or I'm fed up with this music and I want to skip the track. You just press the button. You don't have to fumble for anything. You just press a button. And it like, you can answer calls, you can skip tracks. It's so smart. You can literally stick it anywhere. You can put this on your handlebars and tap it. I personally do like it on my person because then I'm not gonna lose it or forget that it's on my bike. And this is the Honor Dance OWS button. So this, paired with these, absolutely winning, honestly. The Bluetooth button also has an intercom feature. You do need two pairs of headphones for this to work properly. It basically turns your headphones into a walkie-talkie so you can just talk to your friends at the tap of a button. Genius, I love smart products and this is so useful. And honestly, I'm just riding yesterday and I was like, pap, 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 so good. So there we have it. There's my unboxing quick review of the Oladance OWS Sport headphones and the OWS button. So I'll put links to their Kickstarter down below, links to all their product, links to their site. Massive thanks to Oladance for sending these over. It's like an early birthday Christmas present for me. Yeah, any questions, let me know down below. Remember to like, comment and subscribe and I'll catch you guys very soon. Bye.